He is not your responsibility. But He's my brother. Maybe if I go to him, I could it's convince him. It's too late for Clyde. It's never too late. You taught me that. Don't you walk out that door. I've got to go, Blanche. <laughs> you ain't going because you want to bring Clyde back. Well, there ain't nothing here for me. You walk out that door, Daddy, it's over. I mean it. <laughs> Damn it! It does say, hope oh, hell. No, on the sign. Excuse me? The sign, it says hotel. Does it? Yes. Oh. Mm. Well, oh my gosh, it does. Now let's just see what we're going to that now, shall we? Oh, now, is there anything else you'd like to complain about? You're a very frustrated man, aren't you? Oh, I see. It's Dr. Freud now, is it? Well, Doctor, what I really can't stand is stuck-up women from New York with their brains in their backsides! You are, without a doubt, the rudest, most uncouth, roughest man I've ever met! <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> the law has been arresting us since we was kids. You've been stealing since you was kids. Oh, even when we did it. That is true. Uh, Yep. How many times they come by our place, haul us off for no damn reason? Oh, plenty. That's why. And when uh -huh. I worked. Oh, now, now, don't touch me! You are the devil's man! He comes, he comes to me! He just died! Just died! My name! He made me the devil's word! He put my name! I'll murder you! He says it's my boy, Hanks! We must go and open the court, he says! He comes to me, my name! Daddy, you know I'm right. If Clive wants to descend into the depths of hell, he don't have to bring anybody else down with him. Not you, not me, and not that poor, misguided trash you picked up last night. 